In this lecture, we are going to discuss about the operations and maintenance of the rebar bending machine. You can adjust the movable saddle using the adjustment knobs, depending on the size of bars that you want to bend and the angles or rings that you want to make. The locator pin is used to change the angles of the bar by inserting it in one of the holes around the edge of the wheel. Each consecutive hole on the wheel is having difference of 4 degrees. Fit the bush holding pin into the movable saddle. Then fit the checking block onto the bush holding pin. Keep the keeper plate onto the bush holding pin and tighten the bolt with allen key to fit the keeper plate. Use the square pin to lock the checking block by tightening the bolt on the checking block. Fit the stirrup pin in the center hole. Fit another bush holding pin in one of the adjustment hole, as per the bar size. Fit the roller on the bush holding pin, as per the bar size you want to bend. Maintain distance between the bar and bending bush by adjusting the movable saddle. Place the bar on the bend wheel parallel to the checking block and adjust the checking block and movable saddle to adjust the angle in which you want to bend the bar. Press the bending button or foot switch to start bending the bar. The bend wheel starts to move and bar bending starts. Keep pressing the bending button or the foot switch until you achieve the desired shape. The bend wheel stops at the limit switch and returns to its original or home position. The bar is now bent as per the required shape. Multiple shapes can be achieved by adjusting pin as shown above. Different type of ring or stirrups can be made as shown in image. We can place more than one bar at a time to reduce the time. But the quantity should be as per the capacity chart of the machine. Steps for physical maintenance of the machine. Check physical condition of the machine to ensure there are no damages to any parts. Cleaning. Clean the machine after every use. This ensures long life of the machine. Preferably, use a blower or duster after removing the top cover of the machine. Bolts. Ensure all the bolts are tight. Tighten all the bolts once every week. If case of an oil leakage, check the position of leak. Remove the bolts, apply 542 grade lock tight, and retighten the bolts. Stirrup bending pin. Daily check and clean the stirrup bending pin. To ensure long life of the stirrup bending pin, do not attempt to bend bars more than 12 mm diameter. To avoid the pin from sticking in the hole, remove the pin after every day work. Replace the stirrup bending pin as and when required. Bush holding pin. Ensure that you clean the bush holding pin every day and remove it after every use. Center hole. Daily clean the center hole by using oil or dampened cloth. This ensures that whatever bar accumulated is removed and it does not catch the rust. Emergency switch. Ensure that both the emergency switches are working before every use. Foot switch. Ensure that the foot switch is working before every use. Changing oil. In the gearbox, no oil change required, but it is lubricated lifetime synthetic oil and easy fitment. These are some weekly checklist we should be followed. Please download weekly checklist for bar bending machine from the portal. It can be found by searching. And these are some monthly checklist which should be followed. Please download monthly checklist for bar bending machine from the portal. It can be found by searching.